All right, we're talking Tuesday. Today is on Fly Lady's weekly plan. It is her free day. So if today is your busiest day of the week, make that your free day. Mine is Thursday. I have been wrapping up last week on Tuesdays. So to make today your free day or whatever other focus day it is, if today is not your busiest day. If that is confusing, let me know in the comments below. I will address it when I start the live question and answer sessions um, on Sundays while I'm doing my Sunday prep for the week. So um, that will be happening every other Sunday starting in January. So, all right. Now, let's get to that wonderful flight plan. So that way we keep our home, a self-cleaning home. We're taking care of our self-care. And we're doing all those wonderful things that give us the foundation for our daily lives. Okay. All right. Here we go. Did you make your bed? Did you get dressed, shoes, hair, and face? I have definitely found that now with trying and working, I'm going to say my version of the curly girl method because I don't follow it completely. Obviously, I dyed my hair. Um, that's a no-no. So, um. Uh, it takes me longer in the morning to get ready because my hair actually takes time. I can't just throw it up in that messy bun anymore. So, you know, do things appropriately, but it's making me feel better that my hair is done every single day. So go figure, right? Maybe there's something to self-care. Um, and did you swish and swipe? Do a load of laundry from start to finish. So we are talking from sort to put away. I don't care where you started in that cycle, but you need to do one entire cycle. So if you start today with put away, then you need to sort, you need to wash, you need to dry. And then, or you start today with fold and put away, sort, wash and dry happens for the rest of the day. Yes, sweetie. Well, take it out, put it in there. Grandpa's green mint that he steals every time we go by grandma and grandpa's house. All right. So, did you eat all your meals, drink all your water, take all your meds? Did you get all the dishes done for the week? Hi, sweetheart. No, caramel corn. Really? Your mission for today, take 15 minutes and straighten up the laundry room. Now, we did do this last, year, last month, last year. Oh, well, yes, we did it last year, but we did it also last month. So, it shouldn't be that bad. And if you're taking care of things as they come up, it's not going to be an issue. You might have some dusting to do, maybe some mopping to do. Um, I'm lucky my laundry room is in my bathroom. I don't have to worry about that because it gets taken care of when I swish and swipe in the morning. So, and that is your mission for today. And then after that, don't forget you've got your 15 minutes of loving movement. Did you check your calendar this morning or do you need to do that yet? Don't forget you're checking your calendar twice a day at minimum, okay? You check it in the morning to see what you got going on for the day, what you got planned for dinner and everything else like that. Then again, you're checking it in the evening to see what you've got going on for tomorrow. So that way then, don't forget to pull out your clothes for today, tomorrow. Don't forget to set up your launch pad for tomorrow. Don't forget to plan dinner for tomorrow. And don't forget to set up your three SMART goals that you want to accomplish tomorrow. Did, are you working on your SMART goals that you laid out for today? Do you have a plan in place to make sure that you get that next actionable step done? All right. Lunches are taken care of either while you're making dinner, after dinner, before dinner. Uh, Hotspot room rescue. Three cycles of that would be ideal. If you are not there yet, that's fine. Don't forget, you can just, if this is new to you, or maybe there are some things that are harder for you, focus on one thing. When you get that, move on. Um, in my videos that I did for the 31 baby steps, I talk a lot about don't move on to the next step until you've got this one. Because the last thing we want to do is to overload you and overwhelm you. And that's not cool. You're not going to get anywhere that way. Um, shine your sink. I hope that happened. 
And then did you get ready for bed? Go to bed. Did you go to bed yesterday at a decent hour? If not, do you have a plan in place to go to bed at a decent hour tonight? And then, of course, did you pamper yourself and really focus on that self-care today? Um, for a lot of us women and men too, but a lot of us moms, we tend to focus on everybody else and forget about ourselves. Well, we can't do anything for everybody else if we don't focus on ourselves. So keep that in mind. By taking care of yourself, you're really taking care of your children and your husband. So, all right. Now, for the kids. So those of you without kids, I'll see you later. Did they get up, dress to shoes, hair, and face? Did they make their bed? Did they clean their room? Homework is done. Launch pad is taken care of checked off homework and everything like that did they eat all their meals drink all their water take all their meds clothes laid out for tomorrow chores taken care of and are they ready for bed and did they go to bed at a decent hour there you go i'll talk to you tomorrow bye